everybody, it's Mama D. Welcome back to my channel, Mom D Reacts, and we have the fifth episode of uh, season four of Outlander called Savages. So I assume this might have something to do with the Native Americans, but who knows. So let's get going and find out what this episode has got in store. Oh, that's peaceful sounding, isn't it? Mm. She asks us to. What's your want to do? Let's see. Thank you. This will be very useful for Pachanana. Yes, I, uh, have a daughter, but she is far, far away. How oh, sweet. <laughs> so, so. Mm -hmm. Mad. I don't know. In the pigsty. I did not see it. Forget not to be wearing it. <laughs> oh, anyway. Mrs. Beard. Uh, miss. Miss Beard. Excuse I'm me. Roger Wakefield. I think um my girlfriend may have been a guest of yours about ten or so days ago. I, the American. She went to the stones. You know that. She's done gone. Mr. Wakefield. Um, wait. Two seconds. She asked me to wait a year before sending it to you, but well, since you're here a now, year. and Good well, Lord. I can see she broke your heart. How may I help you? Good day, dear mistress. Very good day indeed. You can see Mr. McNeil. I'm told he's the silversmith here in town. He's lying across Creek at present. Do you expect him home soon? Not today. <laughs> no, he's married. Turn around. Well done, Mistress Claire. I had the baby not arrived so soon, I might have learned the entire song. Well, it'll be hard work, as our land's never been cultivated. But any man choosing to settle with me will receive 100 acres. That's a very impressive offer. And no rent until the land yields a good harvest. Again. Thank you. Okay. Right. There's something. They don't want to be involved with the uh, Tryon and the Redcoats, most yeah. likely. Did six farmers just refuse the offer of land? Given within charge. The governor's tax collectors came hand out time and again. And we didn't have the funds to be. They seized horses, livestock, tools, on it and off a penny. Wow. It's the cause of my taking up residence in town. Same for most of the men here. And her Fraser will be home when you return. I expect him back in a few days. But come, let's meet your enemies. We've chosen a name. Baby Clara. Oh, after her. Oh. I'm so honoured. <laughs> Thank you, Petronella. Oh, that was what the doll was at the beginning. <laughs> I want to unknow these people. Why not let them just drink and then be on their way? They have no reason to set foot on my land. Tony, stay, stay. Pamela, Pamela, please. He thank you, my man. I spit it. It's just trying to protect his land. Water belongs to no one. You're right. But he doesn't see it that way. Please, can you take the horses to, to another part of the creek? I go only because you are a friend to Adelaide. Thank you. What is he doing? No, nothing. He's just giving a blessing to the water. Mm -hmm. 
no idea you just a Christmas pork chop, do you? Yeah, right. <laughs> But that tastes like turpentine. Ugh. She's a hard working frontier woman. Christ. The best broken. I'm just getting mad at for his travel. Playing the bar express. Doesn't take no for an answer. Good day, sir. I was hoping for My day is done. I'm tired. It's a wee task. That's Murta. Just a broken bet. No. You made it? I suppose you didn't hear me. I did. But I wonder. I know that voice. You could. That's Murta. Scott. <laughs> I'd be here all night by that logic. No. No more for me today. Your business will have to wait. Please. We have three days travel ahead of us. My uncle will have my guts for guards if I didn't have this mended. Yes! Yes! Get out of Dodge! It's you brutal! You can't pay it, lad. Away with you. Ten shillings. Twenty-one. Ah! Uh, Murta! You don't know this is your relative. <laughs> oh, is he gonna... He probably ain't gonna tell Jamie because he don't know that's Murta. <laughs> Old Mr. McNeil hasn't come home yet. No wonder he might return. You'd care to wait inside. I'll have ah. your hearty piece of pie. I'd wait until she's a good cook. Aye. Right. Okay. She'll whoop your ass if you mess around on her. Believe me. A blacksmith that's a whole coot. Hands off a woman, I thought. How much? Fifty shillings. You hear that? Be fifteen shillings for a bet. Fifteen additional. Whoa! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that was my entire purse. Who's leaving today? Who's going to see him? This is going to be awesome. What the devil's the meaning of charging a lie? 21 shillings for a bet. And you know that voice, don't you, Murtaugh? Don't you? Blacksmith! <laughs> this is going to be classic. This is awesome. <laughs> he knew his voice just like I knew Murtaugh's. Who's she? Yeah. Oh. 
I've never seen her. She's well, living in Boston in the year 1971. Tonight, we drink to the tax collectors. It didn't take Harry's horse, nor Rabbi's cow, nor Johnny's wagon from No, 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 no. Lies not taken. Stolen. Stolen mm -hmm. from them. They were. Stolen. Stolen from us. We stand together. Do need your courage? A rifle or two couldn't hurt either. Time is coming when we will You're a regulator then. Mm-hmm. And a leader. Of the regulators. We didn't have leaders left. Will you join us? No. He made a promise to the governor. He don't break his promises. The gathering this place could well become famous. We risk what we must for our beliefs. The ground came with my shorts that I'll help quell any unrest. Yeah, he don't break his word. I'm having a good conscience involve myself in this. I'm so sorry. I wish there was something that I could have done. There was no use. The curse was strong. Uh, they die very fast. Yeah, measles is a disease. It spreads from person to person. Yeah, it happened to me and my wife in Gunsborg. We were sick for no matter. It is over now. I take care of them for us and for you. Baby Clara's door. Thank you. Oh my God! <laughs> He scapped out of water, the old lady. No frickin' way. You bastard. On the way. On the way, I mean. Oh my god. Oh, it gives me chills. You bastard. She was a healer. She was a witch. Uh, no. There can be no curse without a witch. All they wanted was some water. What is everywhere? Oh my god. You bastard. Come to show that my land is theirs! Yeah, pretty much it was. You took it. Oh, you're gonna pay for that, because when they find out what you did. Goodbye, Fonka. You're gonna be dead, too. Watch. Yep. That's not Claire's house, is it? Oh, God. She's got an arrow in her back. Oh, my God. Jesus. Yeah, that's what you get. Karma's a bitch, as they say. There you go. Payback. Good. I'm glad they knew it was him and Claire didn't have nothing to do. All because you wouldn't let him drink a little bit of water. Oh, thank God. Oh, he knows something's wrong. What's wrong? Just help me. That Murtaugh. The boogie boogie bugle boy. <laughs> they used to sing that when they went around doing that. Oh my god, I forgot. Mother. <laughs> <laughs> you said you weren't coming. Is it really you? No, it's not the boogie boogie bugle. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> oh. oh, awesome. I can't believe this. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, come on. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we're at the stones. Roger. 
If you're reading this, it means that I couldn't make it back. I found out something terrible was going to happen to my mother and Jamie. See? I knew it. If I didn't try to go and help them, I would never have forgiven myself. I need you to know that I cared about you. Oh, Jesus. Very much. Please don't try to follow me, Roger. You once told me to think of my mother happily in the past. And that's how I want you to think of me. Oh, no. He's going to follow you, sister. <laughs> Brianna. Gone through. Wow. Whoa, it gives me chills. The whole thing with Murta back and Brianna on her way over there to see them, how she's going to get from Scotland to America. I don't know. I'm sure it's going to be an adventure. So leave your comments below and click the little button for notifications after you subscribe, of course. We're on our way to a thousand and then infinity beyond and beyond. So, um, Appreciate all you guys being subscribers more than you know. So um, I will talk to y'all later and peace out.